हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल दिस इज द सेकंड फैशन कुर्ती हॉल इफ यू वुड हैव वॉच माय प्रीवियस कुर्ती हॉल वीडियो आई आई हैड मेंशन सेइंग दैट आई हैव फ्यू मोर कुर्तीज व्हिच आई वुड लाइक टू शो यू एंड हियर आई एम दिस इज माय सेकंड सेट ऑफ फैशन कुर्तीज दीस कुर्तीज आर आल्सो वेल लाइक्ड एंड आई लाइक ईच एंड एवरी पीस ऑफ दिस कुर्ती ओके विदाउट फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट इनटू द डिटेल्स एंड द लुक्स ऑफ द कुर्तीज so guys this is my first kurti it's a peacock green kurti and um, it's a peacock green straight kurti which has a middle part uh, detailing and a slit at the end it's basically a plain kurti guys and uh, the material is uh, uh, rayonish bagalpuri type it has a, a shine on the uh, kurti the material is little shiny uh, it is not very glossy but it has a slight tint of um, shimmer or shininess into the cloth and it's mostly uh, embroidery type what i really liked about the kurti the usp of this kurti is the sleeve part of it i just love the sleeve the sleeve is you know with heavy embroidery and uh, it looks very grand as well and the embroidery is also very neat guys it's not just a namesake embroidery the embroidery detailings are so good and this is the best part of the kurti this is what you know actually made me buy this kurti because in my previous haul you would have observed i had shown you another bell sleeve kurti with the almost same color this i bought it in a weeks time i bought that and i couldn't resist buying this kurti because uh, because of the hand the sleeve pattern especially it has a very heavy embroidery these days the blouses the uh, pattu sari blouses comes with heavy embroidery so i felt like you know this look something like that and i loved this kurti also uh, i bought this kurti and i have paired it up with a gold uh, legging and a gold dupatta so this is what i paired it up with it looks super cool guys this is a gold uh, legging and the gold chunni dupatta which i wore along with this it actually matched to perfect and i received lot of very good com compliments from everyone saying that the kurti was looking so grand and uh, this kurti costed around 1000 rupees but when i wore this kurti the entire set looked like you know some very expensive um, dress uh, expensive dress and i was very happy about it coming to the back side of the kurti so the back side is very plain guys there is no design or no detailing into this so it's just plain only the sleeve is uh, 360 degrees it's like full design front back both the both the sides that much only there is a close neck there is no buttons nothing no detailing here it's a very plain uh, back side kurti let's move on to the next kurti so guys this is a second kurti it is a very uh, it is a navy blue we can say navy blue with uh, polka dots kurti golden foil print it's a golden foil print polka dots kurti uh the kurti is a straight kurti with um, middle partition these are false buttons so we we can't remove the buttons but you know it's just um, like a uh, middle partition to kurti and there is a slit here it's a 3/4 kurti and the hands are pretty simple they are straight and uh, they have the same material navy blue with polka dots and if you look at the neck embroidery this is this is what i loved about the kurti it's a collar neck and um, the embroidery detailing is very good it is one side so on one side if you put dupatta also this side it is visible so it's a very big patch kurti uh, embroidery here and coming to the details the uh, it's a wood uh, wood wood based uh, buttons woody buttons with yes wood button with kundans attached in between all the four sides like a flower so that's about the buttons the buttons are very fancy the material is rayonish and overall it looks very nice decent and the fit is also perfect let's uh, see the back side of the kurti so the back side of the kurti looks uh, something like this it's again a very plain uh, back back there is no you know special attractions uh, special things on the back side of the kurti it's very plain and it's a closed neck like how normally the uh, collared neck kurtis are so the cost was around 800 i guess so 
let's move on to the third kurti guys this is the third kurti this is a slightly different pattern um this is a not a straight kurti it's a a line slightly anarkali type we can say and uh, if you look at the sleeves it is bell sleeved so it has bell sleeves and if you look at the neck it is a very close neck a very close neck with nice embroidery here with gold beads attached so those are the detailings and here you see the yellow and cream threads intertwined and is made, and there is an embroidery it looks like a hand embroidery and here also they have done a little bit of hand embroidery and attached to beads to this guys this uh, this kurti i have washed couple of times and i don't see the beads or the embroidery coming out of it so they have stitched it very nicely this costed 1000 rupees uh, i have although altered the length of the kurti made it little bit shorter let's uh, let's see the back side of the kurti so the back side of the kurti has a uh, zip attached here instead of buttons they have kept a zip and the zip is also very sturdy it is very tight and sturdy guys i forgot to mention it also came with a beautiful belt it's a very cute belt a thread belt which has the tassels attached to it woolen tassels woolen and thread tassels attached to it which means we can adjust the you know the uh, the hip uh, measurement and uh, the look of the kurti enhances because of the um belt here and also the design here if you see below the um belt it is like pleats which also you know uh, gives a different edge to the kurti in total so let's move on to the next kurti guys this is my final kurti this is a green printed cotton kurti or a jacquard kurti i guess so the fabric i'm just guessing guys i'm not 100% sure but it looks like a jacquard kurti material uh this is a set kurti doesn't come with a dupatta but it has a kurti and a pant matching pant it costed 1500 rupees and this is how it looks so it basically is a combination of two materials this one this dark green and this one here you can see on the neck sleeves and the pant okay so it's a combination of two ma two materials the neck detailing is very pr pretty simple there is no beads or embroidery attached to this uh it's a regular office wear college wear kurti this again i have worn it couple of times i have washed it the color didn't bleed the material hasn't changed a bit also it's it is uh, it's a very strong uh, material it's not a light material and uh, you you can see the neck detailing here uh again here it came with uh, tassels there was two tassels here and here which i had cut it because i was not very comfortable with the tassels so i cut it but otherwise even the tassels were looking little fancy and i loved it so much but because it was so uncomfortable when wearing i just cut it off removed it it's a 3/4 kurti it's a slightly longer than 3/4 kurti i would say uh, sleeve and uh, this uh, patch this patch which they had joined had actually given a very good to the uh, look of the kurti here again if you can see that there is a pleats kind of stitch to this which actually changes the look of the kurti and uh, the uh, they have attached the, the bit here also the second patch and the border all this actually you know enhances the look of the kurti uh, there is a slit side slits and uh, let's see the pant how the pant looks it's a straight pant guys it's a straight pant uh, and there is elastic here and like the strings so uh, elastics are pretty you know comfortable for me uh, rather than the strings so i like the pant also overall you know for uh, summers uh, this is a very good option the back side of the neck is pretty simple guys i'll show you in a minute so the back side is uh, plain close neck and the same uh, design what you see in the front you will see at the back in here in between this there is this again uh, pleat type fashion pleat type kurti here uh, stitch here which uh, brings about a different look to the kurti and the down part again has the same uh, bit same different fabric attached to this with the lining on uh, sorry not the lining the lace so that's about the last kurti so that's about it guys i hope you like my kurti collection uh, 
like i said in my previous video if you want to buy fashion kurtis you have to go to their website it's www.fashion.com they have a huge collection and variety of kurtis the stitch and the flow of the kurtis also very unique and different the materials fabrics are also different uh, the quality is also very satisfying and again guys this is not a sponsored product all these kurtis are, are bought by me um, so because i love this brand i thought i had i have to do a review on this with this my fashion kurti collection comes to an end um hope you like my video if you like my video do like share comment and subscribe to my channel see you in my next video until then take care bye bye